Hi, baby. Good morning, welcome back to my channel. Happy Friday. We're just gonna hang out this weekend and I'm just gonna vlog Bella. You gotta chill, okay? This dog is next level, hold on. You crack me up. You literally crack me up. Roll over. Bella, up on your hind legs. Good girl, good girl, good girl, sit. Now you get your treat. She doesn't have teeth either, and so she just swallows it, so it's gone. You just swallowed. Hi, I'm on my way to Coralville, which is like, I live in Iowa City in Iowa. These are probably like, this girl lives in Iowa, what the hell? But um, yeah, I live in Iowa City, um, and Coralville's like, just like a different neighborhood. Like if you're a Chicago girly, it's like Streeterville if you live in River North. Um, but anyway, sorry. Um, but anyways, I am headed there because I'm gonna go to Yoga Sculpt last minute at Hot House. Like literally so last minute. The class is in 12 minutes. But I'm going because I didn't realize it was in Coral though. It's <laughs> because they also have a location in Iowa City. Um, but anyway, so I'm in my car. I've got my cold brew with half and half and it hits dip today. It's so good. Mm. Anyways, and a water in my bag. I'm meeting a friend for a walk at 10.30. Um, so this is going to be like a really quick turnaround because the class is at 9. Right now it's 8.49. <laughs> and uh, I'm going to get there right at 9. And I'm going to have to leave right at 10 so that I can get home and quickly change. And now there's like a fucking truck. It's like backing up and I'm really annoyed right now. Okay, um, the truck moved. But anyways, we're gonna have a great day. I am going to this class and then I'm meeting my friend for a walk. Um, and honestly, this is just your sign right now, so I have always like known this girl, but like like we've never been super close. But I've always thought she was like really cool, and she actually teaches at the yoga studio I go to. And so I saw her the other day, and I was like, we should go for a walk sometime. And honestly, just like that's the thing about friendships. Like if you feel like you might hit it off with someone, shoot your shot because like nine times out of ten, they probably feel the same way. I mean, unless like they don't, and if they don't, then who cares? You know, that's like. I just think that's so important with cultivating friendships is just like being open to allowing them. Um, but anyways, I am gonna log off because I wanna listen to some music because you guys, I've been in a music rock for the past like two years and I am finally back on my music grind and I couldn't be happier about it. I am on Spotify. It's just at Mary Montanero, but um, I, I'm like, I don't know. I just finally feel like I can make playlists and actually enjoy them again. Whereas like for a while, I just didn't feel like the calling to be on my music grind. So my latest playlist that I'm really liking is called Boot Up. It's just because the first name of the song is called that. I'll do that a lot. So I never know what to name playlists. Um, so yeah, you should listen to it. I think it has some bops on it. It's a really good playlist for like, cooking in the summer like windows open candles going that vibe um i love like r b like i love janae echo i love summer walker i love that vibe so just for reference that's the kind of music i listen to but then on the opposite end i also really like folk music like i love gregory zakov i love um, Lord Huron, I love the occasional Lumineers. Actually, in all honesty, like, I like the Lumineers, but I think there's a lot better. Like, they're very hyped. 
which like I respect like I think he has a great voice and I've actually seen them live and they do a really great job but like I don't know I think some of the smaller like bands and people are where it's at like Gregory Zaka for example that guy is insane live and like yeah and he's actually really good live that I've seen like four times is Ed Sheeran I'm not even kidding he is so good live Hi guys, I just took my grandma to an appointment, came home to make a quick juice and grab a bite. And then I'm gonna go back and pick her up, and take her home and do the things, but I just wanted to update you guys. Then I'm gonna run down to the store and pick up just a couple little items for her. She wants like some cookies and a muffin, things like that. Guys, the vibes are immaculate. <laughs> My mom is such a queen and I just feel like such a queen staying here. So I'm like sleeping in her room and stuff and I just, nothing is like that, you know? But I just showered. I have not vlogged all day because, <sighs> let me see the last time. Yeah, like I haven't vlogged forever, but I picked my grandma up and then I went to Lulu. My camera's gonna die, but I went to Lulu and saw Nat and I picked up a couple things because they were actually doing a little like friends and family thingy. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. I got this top, it's called the Align Waist Length Razorback. It's so cute, it's a little high neck. And then the Instill in um, navy and the Instill in gray. So I'm going to put my camera on the charger um, and have dessert and go to bed, but I will see you guys in the morning. Little farmer's market haul. Honestly, nothing hits like the Iowa City Farmer's Market, in my opinion. Radishes, kale, butter, lettuce, zucchini, um, tomato, asparagus, and rainbow chard. I'm gonna do a quick workout and then get this all Good morning vlog. We haven't really talked in all honesty. Um, yesterday I didn't really vlog much because I was kind of just running around. I went to the farmer's market and then I took, or I went out to my grandma's and I was just kind of like hanging out. Um, and then uh, this morning I took, I slept in a little bit. Mm, this coffee. Oh my God, so good. I'll tell you what it is in a second. I slept in a little bit, took Bella out for a nice walk, um, and then came back, um, did my morning routine, did some Pilates. I just finished my Pilates. It's now 10 a.m. I made a coffee. I had a black coffee this morning that I just took a few sips of, and then I just topped it off, added some half and half, and a touch of maple syrup. It's so good. The perfect little Sunday treats. Um, and now I'm going to head out and go for a long walk. Just me. I'm thinking I'm going to do this route that my dad always does. It's not super long, actually. It's like a three mile route, but it's a really good walk. So I'm going to do that and then come back sauna. I want to get my stuff together since I'm leaving tomorrow morning. I want to go get groceries and I'll just put those in the cooler overnight. I'm gonna do some prep for tonight because I was gonna make my mom and I dinner. And honestly, like I've eaten out every night. I'm sick of eating out. <laughs> Had enough. I feel like I'm like puffy from it and I just like, I'm over it. Um, it was really nice though. Um, but my mom has a stomach flu, which sucks. So I was gonna make this a really nice dinner tonight, but obviously that's not gonna happen. Well, she doesn't have the stomach flu. She has food poisoning. So she's flying home right now. I'm going to pick her up from the airport around 4.30. Um, and so, yeah, it's a shitty situation. But that is our plan. Um, and, yeah, I'm just going to go for a walk. I'm not going to bring you guys on a walk, but I'll see you guys after. Hi, guys. I just got out of the sauna. I literally feel 
so good. I got out of the sauna and then I popped some of that oil that I told you guys I'm obsessed with in my last video, or two videos ago, my favorites video. I put some of that in my hair um, because I like to oil my hair on Sundays and then just stick it back and then before I go to bed, I'll take a bee shower. It's the best thing ever. And I'm making a huge ice water. It just sounds so good in ice water with some lime. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm headed out right now to go take my grandma some groceries and change her sheets um, for her. Maybe I'll vlog with Mimi. She's such a character. Like, I literally love my grandma. Um, oh, this lime is kind of hard. Um, but anyways, I'm gonna go do that. I'm gonna go meet Nat on her break at Lulu and we're gonna go for a quick little walkie. Um, but yeah, it's been a really nice Sunday morning. Like, I've realized that my favorite way to spend a Sunday is like, change the sheets. So yes, sometimes that means I change my sheets twice a week, but she's crazy, I know. Um, but I love to change my sheets and then um, do a really, I'm putting water, but do a really kick-ass workout. Like regardless, like usually Pilates, because you guys know me, I'm a total Pilates girl, um, but like, I want it to be a hard Pilates, like maybe with some cardio involved. And then go for a really long walk, like not even really long, just like one where I get a sweat going. You know what I mean? Like one that leaves me like feeling like I got a workout in. Um, so this morning's was three miles and I'll honestly definitely go out for another walk. And then sweat. Like if I had a sauna, I'd be in it every single day. But okay, I really have to go. So I'm bringing you guys with. Hi guys. Okay, I'm home. I just made a juice. I did all the things and Bella is so tired. But I'm gonna make some food and then I'm gonna go down to the bread garden and do all of my grocery shopping. First I need to upload this TikTok, but I'm gonna do all of my grocery shopping for before I leave tomorrow just so that it's done. Honestly, a big bowl of fruit in the summer just hit stiff, you guys. Hi guys, I just took the shower. I wanna show you my outfit because it's a little out of my comfort zone, but I actually got this skirt. I feel like you can't see it. I feel like I have to like do this. This skirt from Revival and it had tags on and it's this Australian brand. And it's so fun, you guys, it's like, a $300 skirt but I got it for like 40 bucks and I think it's so cute with this top too. I'm obsessed but this is my dog walking fit because I'm gonna go take Bella for a walk and then I'm gonna come home and do like kind of seems weird since I'm leaving but I'm gonna do some meal prep that then my mom can have for the week but yeah. Okay guys Bella has been taken out and I am going to start doing some cooking but first lemon apron goes on yes I have an apron for my mom's too and honestly I like it maybe even more than I like the one that's at home because it has lemons on it which reminds me of Italy and so who knows maybe I'll be taking this one too but apron is on music is about to be back on in two seconds Okay. You digging? She seems confused. Good morning, you guys. I just did a Pilates workout. I got this hat from my dad's. It's my dad's brewery. I think it's kind of cute, right? Hi, guys. I don't know why I said hi, guys. I'm <laughs> putting it on, but. Just need a little coffee moment. 
cold brew with half and half. Honestly, my current fave. It's so good. It's just so simple. So good. Okay. My mom and I are going to go for a walk. She's home. And yeah, it's overcast today. I don't know what time I'm leaving slash if I'm leaving today. Everything's ready to go, but I might just like bow out tomorrow morning. We'll see. But outfit, Susanna Monaco, split 59. Hi cuties. So I am still in Iowa City. Um, I'm not leaving today. I'm gonna leave tomorrow. My mom and I are spending the day together. So I wanted to show you guys a little revival in Catherine's Hall. First item is from Velvet from Catherine's and it's this little tank. It's just a really simple linen tank. I think it's so cute. So got that on. Also, hold on. A little revival bag wanted to show you guys okay also my dad gave me this i swear every time i leave iowa city i leave with such good goodies but it's a little um who's the court of posse family i have no idea but the court of posse family gave us this and you can put stuff on it and it just says vino vecchio e olio novello which means old wine and new olive oil. Um, I got these, not at Revival. Revival's coming, but I got these so that Blake and I can take them out on our deck because we can't have glass up there. So those are a great little thing to have. And then I got the skirt I was wearing yesterday, which I showed you guys from Revival. I got this Frank and Eileen top, which I'm obsessed with Frank and Eileen, but I only buy it from Revival because it's so expensive otherwise um but it's just this little linen shirt i got this actual it's just a lulu bra but i got it because it goes with um the leggings that i have and i just love the power y tank um i mean the power y you guys know bra and then i got this little velvet sweatshirt that's actually so soft and so cute on so that's what i picked up from revival and then today at Catherine's, I got this. So I got this, and then I got this, the great hoodie or sweatshirt that is so cute on in this green color. I love the great sweatshirts, they're the best. And then I got this Monroe set, which is just coral, and it's these cutie little shorts and then this adorable matching top oh, so cute okay my mom's here and we're gonna go do some shopping for her patio dinner farm front hi guys i'm home and unpacked and i'm about to make some food i'm starving it is like oh blake's gone hold on anyways okay made a green juice I am going to get some stuff done, but I will see you guys in my next vlog. I love you. Thank you for tagging along on my Iowa City adventures. So many updates to come um, and changes in both Blake and I's life. So stay tuned for more. Okay. I clearly like need to just like take a second chill. <sighs> I feel like I've been going, going, going all day. Okay. Love you. Bye.